The Magic Trackpad and the Logitech MX Anywhere 3S offer two very different mouse experiences when used with Mac OS. The Magic Trackpad gives you a more laptop-like feel, while the MX Anywhere 3S gives you an ergonomic yet compact mouse experience. And in this video, we're gonna go over the differences between the Magic Trackpad and the MX Anywhere 3S, in which situation I would buy the trackpad or the mouse. The Apple Magic Trackpad uses one finger to move the mouse around, two fingers to scroll and zoom, three fingers or four fingers to switch between apps, and it's just a super easy to use experience. The Logitech MX Anywhere 3S, you move the mouse around to change where you're pointing, and you have left and right click buttons as well as a scroll wheel, so it gives you a little bit more of a tactile experience. The Anywhere 3S also has two programmable buttons on the side, a programmable button that's built into the scroll wheel and one below the scroll wheel. So you can use the Logi Options Plus app to add your own shortcuts into the mouse. The Magic Trackpad gives you gestures and that smooth scrolling that is just so easy to use and it feels really seamless if you're used to using an Apple laptop. It's very precise, although it's not quite as precise as using a mouse. But I've seen a lot of people who use the trackpad exclusively and they get amazing results doing both photo and video editing and just your general computer work too. The Magic Trackpad uses lightning to both charge and pair to a computer and the MX Anywhere 3S uses USB-C to recharge and it has a device pairing button on the bottom so that you can put it in Bluetooth pairing mode and you can also cycle between up to three saved devices. So it's great if you wanna use it with multiple computers, iPads, or other devices just by flipping it over and cycling between the different devices you're connected to. The MX Anywhere 3S is quite a bit smaller in width than the Magic Trackpad, although it is a little bit thicker than some of the other Apple mouses that are out there. By the time you're moving the mouse around though, they take up about the same footprint on a desk setup. I really miss gestures when I use the MX Anywhere 3S. I did program one of the top buttons to activate gestures so you can click that and move the mouse one direction or the next, but it's not quite as smooth of an experience as using the built-in gestures to the Apple Magic trackpad. I do find that the MX Anywhere 3S is overall a more comfortable to use mouse though. It's just a better wrist position for you to use using the MX Anywhere 3S over using the Magic trackpad. Sometimes with the Magic trackpad, my hand can get a little bit uncomfortable over time. The MX Anywhere 3S goes for about $80 and the Apple Magic Trackpad goes for around $130 to $150 depending on if you get the white one or the space gray one. The MX Anywhere 3S is also available in black, graphite, pale gray, and rose so there's more colors that you can get it in too. I think picking between these two devices basically comes down to if you want the trackpad experience that the Magic Trackpad provides or if you want the more precise mouse experience that the MX Anywhere 3S provides as well as having some of those dedicated device buttons for changing what device you're connected to and the programmable buttons on the side and the top. I think if you're looking for that laptop-like experience, you'll really appreciate the Magic Trackpad. Just know that it's not as ergonomic as buying the MX Anywhere 3S. I'd buy the MX Anywhere 3S if you're looking for a more ergonomic, yet still portable setup for throwing a mouse into your backpack, but also still packing a great punch in a desktop situation using it at your home office or an office, and then being able to quickly store it and go somewhere else with it is a great feature of the MX Anywhere 3S. If you're interested in buying either the Apple Magic Trackpad or the Logitech MX Anywhere 3S, I have links in the description below. If you have any other questions about either of these, be sure to check out my dedicated review videos of the MX Anywhere 3S and the Apple Magic Trackpad. Also, feel free to leave a comment with any questions down below, and I'll do my best to answer them.